Hello and welcome to the Photography and Videography channel. I'm Nigel Cooper and during today's short video presentation, I'm going to show you how to use a voiceover tool with DaVinci Resolve on a Mac. The version of DaVinci Resolve I'm using here is 16.2.7.010 and the software on this particular iMac is version 10.14.6. Now I will just point out when I installed this version of Resolve onto this version of the Mac software, I did run into a small glitch. You may or may not run into the same one, but if you do, I will show you how to quickly overcome that. So I've got this clip down here on the timeline. It's only a short clip of a few seconds. So what you do is you right click over here on the left under your audio track, click add track, mono. And what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna rename this so it'll be easy for me to find. And then you come over here and click on the Fairlight tab. And the first thing you do is click on Fairlight at the top here, go down to Patch Input Output. And if Audio Inputs isn't selected by default, you select it here because this is where any microphones you have plugged into your computer will show up. So I'm just gonna click on the built-in microphone here. And the destination, again, if track input is not selected, you select track input so that your tracks will show up here. This is the audio track for voiceover that I've just created. So I'm gonna click on that. And then down here at the bottom on the right, you click patch. And I can now close this window by clicking on this little X here. Now, if I click on the record button here, that's not going to actually start recording. It will simply load the track in preparation for recording so that you can see the view meters. Now here, they're a little bit hot, so I'm just gonna bring that down a little bit so it's not clipping. And then what you do is, when you click on the record button here, the video will start playing, so you can follow that as you lay down your audio, and when you've finished, you simply click stop. So let me just go ahead and do that, do that now to show you how it works. So here I've got a nice photographic background set up in the studio in preparation for a photo shoot. So I click stop and as you can see it's laid down the audio track there so when you go back to the edit tab you have the audio track down on the voiceover track and you can go ahead and edit that as you would any other audio. Now a minute ago I did mention that there might be a problem on the Mac so um, if I go back over to Fairlight when you click this R button to load up the track if these view meters don't move and you don't get any audio input at all you simply go to the Mac system preferences and in here you click security and privacy, then you click privacy, and then you go down to microphones, and in here you'll see DaVinci Resolve. Now when I loaded Resolve onto the Mac, it was unchecked by default, and if this is unchecked, then you don't get any meter movement, you don't get any audio input at all. So you simply check it there, and then all should be okay. So that's how you use the voiceover tool in DaVinci Resolve. I hope you like this tutorial. I'm Nigel Cooper. This is the Photography and Videography channel. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you again real soon.